up guys um getting ready to do a late night clean with me um everybody well my babies are asleep and when i say babies i mean the two youngest ones are asleep so i am trying to talk below so i hope you guys can hear me but yeah the house i, I guess it's not too too bad but there is um parts of it and i do already have the um couch cooled out. I'm sorry guys, I have a light right here because it is it's nighttime, so I'm not working out the natural light. So um yeah. But I have my couch pulled out right now because I'm getting ready to um just do a deep clean down here. Just do a deep clean down here, sweeping stuff like that. I think I'm also gonna use my Swiffer. I would love to mop, but I'm really not just in the, I'm not in the mood. It's already about 11 o'clock, so trying to get this done at least by 12. Um, and yeah, guys, we're going to get into this video. And I Hi, guys, and welcome back to my video. This video is definitely going to be a little bit different than um, my other videos. I am going to be doing a late night clean with you guys. Um, I really do hope this video brings you the motivation that you need to get your house in order. You guys, I was definitely struggling this night to get this video done. Not even to just get the video done, just to clean in general. But um, yeah, I got it done. Um, I'm gonna be cleaning up one of these chairs right now. I'm using my Swiffer. Um, I did want to mop like I previously said, but I just decided that the Swiffer would be a lot easier and it would take up less time. And I can also try to meet my goal time, which was 12 a.m. And you guys will see if I was able to meet that time or not. So we're gonna get back into it, y'all. Yeah. just so surprised at the amount of stuff that just be under, the, under these chairs and honestly you guys I knew that I had to get it done because it would just irritate me every time I was sitting at my dining table well the kitchen nook area and I can just see straight up under the chairs like every little thing <laughs> I could see it and it was annoying me but um I did need to go ahead and get that clean and then um, while I was sweeping I could tell that there was something else up under this couch so that's why I went ahead and just pushed it up a little bit more um, but yeah you guys we're gonna get back into it at this video i'm honestly judging my curtains more and more um i'm not really sure on my curtains you guys i think i just have to just continue to put it together um maybe i can tie it together if i switch out the rug um i honestly don't want to pay for a rug right now so i don't know we're gonna have to see how we can tie them curtains in a little bit better um and even over here as i was looking at this video um 
I know when I was picking out my kitchen nook table that I wanted something that didn't have any type of fabric on it just because of the kids. And because of that, my choices were very limited. Um, I feel like they don't make chairs um, where they don't have cloth as nice as the ones that you would prefer not to have cloth. So um, I just went what I felt like was best for the family, which was non-cloth chairs, um, especially since I have two little ones right now. Um, and with that, I am struggling with these curtains. I'm not sure if they go. Um, it's actually throwing me off right now. I want to say maybe a rug could tie it in together, but honestly, I don't even think that'll work. I think I would completely have to change these curtains out of here. And you guys, <laughs> I had to add it in. I just had to. But um, yeah, you guys can let me know what you think. Um, I'm not really sure how I'm feeling right now. I definitely want to change the curtains, but um, we'll see, you guys. Tell me what you're feeling, why you chose to take this road But I'm not willing to give up myself for you to take control You've been saying all the words, but I'm still circling in love Baby, you don't even take the trouble oh. You guys, I was able to get my new kink sink faucet install and i love it um i definitely think it just ties in good with everything um right here you guys this is definitely a rare scene for my videos because i love using my dishwasher but i did just decide to just go ahead and wash these it wasn't that big of a load it wasn't it wasn't even necessary for me to even try to put that in a dishwasher especially since i know i would need the same um, bowls and stuff for the next day for the kids so it just made sense just for me just to go ahead and hand wash them and I did I am using my Dawn dish detergent I'm also using this scrub sponge I have a hard time finding scrub daddy I really do um, I love scrub daddy scrub daddy I always recommend that for you guys whenever you're hand washing your dishes I do love to rinse my dishes as well after I wash them um, that's just my preference um, and yeah you guys Let's get back into it. cleaned down off the sink um i would like to also like wipe my sink area just because it does get a little messy whenever i am doing my dishes but yeah you guys I'm gonna get back into it oh and yes so i am taking out my trash right now I just went ahead and just set it outside um so that that morning my husband could just go ahead and take it out for the trash pickup for that day and yeah
I have been using my stainless steel spray on my refrigerator, but I'm not too sure that that's actually working on this refrigerator. I honestly want to, um, I don't know. I just want to call about this refrigerator. I'm not too sure about it. Um, we haven't had it for too long, not even a year yet. We did get it this year because the one that we had when we first moved in, it did um, go out on us. So we did purchase a new one and yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about it supposed to be like the fingerless touch refrigerator i don't know you guys it seems very finger touchy to me <laughs> but i'm just finishing up you guys we are making our way to the end of this video i really do hope you have appreciated it thus far if you have made it to the end i thank you so much if you haven't done so already please like comment and subscribe and make sure that notification bell is on so you're notified every time i post a video and i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys